Arc 2 is not scheduled to come out until next year now, in fact the end of next year. So if you're looking for a brand new dino action game, what could you be playing? This is Instinction. Yes, there may be a remaster of Ark on its way this year supposedly, but I'm looking for something new, something brand new that I can enjoy, hopefully in a world filled with dinosaurs, and in this case, a little bit more supernatural going on. Now, this isn't the first time I've taken a look at Instinction, but today at the Future Game Show, they revealed they're going into early access this year. A bit surprising, as I understood it, they'd be coming out as a full game in 2025 and wouldn't be doing early access, but looks like they've changed their mind or maybe that was the plan all along and it's going to be coming out I'm guessing towards the end of the year. There was an issue with the Future Game Show, they basically cocked up the trailer halfway through and now I'm giving you the full definitive one. Made in Unreal Engine 5, this is the future of survival and dinosaur games. So made by a small team, yada yada yada, they got some extra investment this year by the looks of things and they've been ramping up production, getting more developers on board and it looks like Instinction is going to be a real possibility of maybe a good dino action adventure game. It's not going to be a fully fledged sandbox experience. As you can see from their recap video, wide linear level design, exploration and puzzle solving with prehistoric creatures developed in that Unreal Engine and it will be releasing on consoles. Now for some, you may be about to click off already. Oh, I want my survival sandbox. Others really just love the idea of the dinosaurs in Art Survival Evolved and are looking for more experiences that have them competing against them, trying to survive or necessarily using some of the dinosaurs to help you. How that will actually pan out, I'm not too sure, but that's a line I saw on either the website or the Steam page. Experience a cinematic story based upon action-adventure with combat, exploration and puzzles where the environments can be as treacherous and beautiful as the creatures you encounter. So it looks like they've just updated their Steam page to reflect maybe where the game's at at the moment. They had a story synopsis, but it looks like it has changed slightly, including the main name of the main character. You are Isabel, an adventurous ecologist, aka Tomb Raider, with a mysterious connection to the Rift. You're going to be thrust into this strange new world full of primeval dangers and incredible beauty. You'll have to navigate treacherous and gorgeous environments, solve challenging puzzles, and survive in a world filled with deadly living history. You'll be tracing your family's history back to the valley, how your history is tied to the people that once lived here, and yeah, hopefully it could be potentially good. There are quite a few of these types of games on the horizon in the next year and a half or two years. We've got things like Gona, and then we've got Dinos Reborn, some other games as well that I'm going to be doing pretty much a top seven dinosaur games you need to know about incoming. But I like the focus on this one, the FPS aspects of it, shooting actual dinosaurs and try and survive. We'll have to see how deep they might go with survival mechanics, but it looks like it's probably going to be pretty light. And let's hope that their level design is definitely challenging, but refreshing, so it's not just corridors filled with dinosaurs we'll come up against. Kind of crazy, we're seeing more of a game made by a tiny little crew, a brand new IP, much earlier than we're actually seeing of a known franchise like Ark Survival Evolved. This game could potentially be coming out properly before actually Ark 2 does. Given that Ark 2 is leaning more into that single player experience, apparently with Vin Diesel pretty much aping God of War. So in purely terms of single player, I think I'd rather play this than any kind of God of War ripoff. Looks like it's going down that little bit of a route of like Green Hell style, where you may have to see if you can actually trust what you're seeing before your eyes. Is it an illusion? Is it your own madness? Or is it really some sort of time jumps? The dinosaur models look great. I think they look fantastic. The animations are decent enough. Obviously, everything's a bit slow-mo and a little bit structured. We'll have to see how it really runs when you've got something chasing you and you're running through the forest at like 10 miles an hour. But good stuff from the Instinction team, and I'm eager to see what happens next. Hopefully, we can get involved in this playtest. So enough of supporting shoddily companies that treat their players like crap. Embrace the new that is on the horizon. Even if sometimes it's not directly the thing that you've been playing or have appreciated, I think if we can give some encouragement to some of these new games, we can definitely see some real gems emerge. Like I said, I'll give you the lowdown on all the other survival style dinosaur games that I've kept my eye on over the last year, and that will be coming very, very soon. Let me know what you think about this one, and until next time, Rat Bags, I'll catch you later.